probably overheard this, but Nancy um, is, is a surprise mystery guest that <laughs> Mike said was coming, but didn't name who. Nancy was part of News Ministries. You got involved, we first met in 98. And talk, we were talking about pilgrimages last night. She went on that first pilgrimage that I went on mm -hmm. to the Holy Land. And we were roommates in the Holy Land. And, uh, and she got involved in, back then we had tapes. This was before the days of CDs. <laughs> she was in charge of the tape ministry, music ministry too, playing guitar. And uh, in, in one particular event, she traveled with us to Ogdensburg Diocese in upstate New York, right along the St. Lawrence River. And where Ralph, her, and I gave it a, a week long pastoral institute on evangelization. Mm -hmm. We were like Lucy, Lucy and Ethel. <laughs> we got a lot of trouble. <laughs> and always got out of it just yeah, fine. We got out of it. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Terry, this is just the beginning of the wonderful things God has planned for you. For I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord, they are plans for good, to give you a future and a hope. Jeremiah 29 11, which is one of my. Favorite scriptures. Yeah, absolutely. It has a perfect card. And she bought this. Oh, it has strong fingers. Okay. You're good. No, actually, it was oh, a little bit too nice. Four boxes out of four. St. Paul, right? Yeah. Lovely. St. Paul. Beautiful. So for the St. Paul. The sword and, and yeah, the word. Yeah, nice. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> this, uh, this statue of the Blessed Mother was provided by uh, one of my Daily Reflections readers. Uh, she, when I had put out the word that we had opened up this seminar place, uh, and I would love to have a statue of our number one patron for the ministry, the Blessed Mother, and I was hoping somebody would donate it, that very day she had received in the mail this. She had a ministry, has a ministry of distributing them on to anybody that she feels the Blessed Mother is saying give this to. So she felt this was meant to be here and therefore it got here. So again, welcome. Thank you very much for, for coming today and being part of this historic moment as we initiate this St. Paul seminar room and our new office suite facilities here. Uh, we we obtained it on February 1st and have been working on getting it supplied and and the kitchen installed and that sort of thing. So uh, it's been it's been an exciting Lent as we've uh, Lent is going by very fast for me this year because of all this work we're doing in getting this place set up and still trying to keep up with everything else. <laughs> uh, but we feel that this is just the beginning, even though it's a small crowd here this morning. We have a larger crowd coming this afternoon. But um, this, we, we feel that the Lord has led us to this place. It's an ideal setup. The landlady is just wonderful. And this was made possible by a donation at the end of the end of year fundraiser. A lady in Singapore donated $10,000. And that exactly covered rent for a year for this place. So I knew God wanted this to happen. And I truly believe that he's not going to start something to let it last only a year. It's going to grow and build. And we have a lot of things that we've been asking the Holy Spirit, our staff. We pray together once a week in a staff meeting. And, and we do a lot of brainstorming. and listening to the Holy Spirit as to what to do with this place.